Tag team action is next, and it's happening right here. Don't go away. It'll be the Wyatt family versus the Lucha Dragons. Oh, my! entrance king you're not kidding i think i just saw a grown man crying in the third row it doesn't get much more exciting than these teams set to square off here tonight And here we go, this tag team match is going to be heated, to say the least. Now well, there's no telling what we're gonna see here. Can't wait to see which one of these teams will be standing at the end. And wow, Kalisto carries the hopes and dreams of the Mexican people on his shoulders, and he looks more than capable of carrying them. What do you think about Bray Wyatt? In a tag team, being a good partner is as important as anything else. How can he do his part tonight in this one? Bray Wyatt alone is intimidating. Bray Wyatt plus one has to be plain nerve-wracking for these guys. Here's the thing. This match, of course, isn't for the championship. But the champ can't afford to look past this one. If he does, he could lose momentum or even worse, get an injury. Well, I've never seen him do that before. Plenty of high flyers over the years, Cole. And after watching Sid Carter for a few years now, I'd have to say that he belongs among the elite class of WWE high flyers. I mean, he's just so amazing to watch. Simply put, any offense that lands above the shoulders can change the outlook of a match in an instant. Look at this 
man. He's all business. And that's the way he has to be if he wants to win here tonight. Thinking about it now, I'd have to agree with you, Kenny. You see, Carter's awe-inspiring aerial assault certainly rivals that of Jimmy Snooker, Rob Van Dam, Rey Mysterio, and the other greats that have taken to the sky here in WWE. You know, it's almost as if the man can literally defy gravity. I know it sounds funny, but it's not all that far off. One move after the other. It's devastating. This is hard to watch. This is going to be bad. Ah, Kalisto showing some adversity right now. Zeroing in on the shoulder now. Big Eric Rowan starting to slow down some. Heading into this match, he and his partner look extremely confident. But it's important to know that this match has been so evenly contested so far, you really can't pick a winner. And on top of that, John, these two guys couldn't be any more evenly matched at this point. Kalisto showing signs of slowing down. At this point, it's all about how he responds and potentially rebounds. And it looks to me like neither of these guys are showing signs of pulling away here. Well said, John, and now's the time for one of these guys to take hold of this match. Oh, and a terrific work. Police still into the cup. Bray Wyatt going for it early. He's making a statement here with this attack. Strike hit the spot. There's no way he could have avoided that blow. Taking this type of punishment must be damaging to his sternum. Damaging to his entire chest. Oh, look at Looking for the quick cover is Kalisto. He's in full on attack mode now. First time for everything, I guess. The tag is made. some space or else this thing's over. But I think you'll agree, we'd be crazy to count him out now. There's still plenty of fight left in him. True, and I find it curious that he's spending so much time outside the ring here. Oh, that's gonna hurt, come on! Now he just wants that insult injury. Yeah, this guy's a mean streak. How will these guys do with absorbing the punishment they're about to receive out here? Looks like somebody wants back in this match. Boy, there's no way he's going to be able to stand after that. What you'd seen Carl be looking to do now, King. And at this point, you have to wonder if he can recover from this. We got a cover. Some good work here. Hey, Sin Cara, no problem getting out of that one. Eric Rowan is in serious peril. Is there anything that can be done to get back to being a threat? 
rather than continuing to absorb any more punishment, he might want to tag out here. You said it, and he does not want to let his opponent gain some steam here and start to get the upper hand.